When the Church of Scotland was split in two by the disruption in 1843, Reverend John Macmillan left the parish church and became the first minister of Kirkubri Free Church, which was afterwards called St Mary's. The disruption came about because there was a split between those who maintained that the lairds should have the right to choose their ministers and those who felt it was up to the congregations to decide this. After years of dissension, the General Assembly drew up a claim of rights that was presented to the government in 1842. According to this, the Kirk had complete spiritual independence and the state had no right to interfere in spiritual matters. The government refused to accept this, and so at the General Assembly in 1843, a walkout took place and the Free Church of Scotland was born. In all, 470 ministers left the Kirk at this time, accompanied by many elders, communicants and adherents. At the time of the disruption in 1843, there was also in Kirkubri an associate church which had been founded by the Succeeders in 1820. In 1847 it became known as United Presbyterian Church of Kirkubri. So at this point in history there were three churches in Kirkubri, the parish church in its present building, Kirkubri Free Church and the United Presbyterian Church which moved from High Street where Mitchell's antique store is, to a new building in St. Cuthbert Street in 1880, which is now the present site of Tesco Supermarket. In 1900, this last church took the name of St. Cuthbert's United Free Church and amalgamated with Kirkubri Free Church to form the United Free Church of Kirkubri, with worship being held in St. Mary's building. Finally, in 1929, this church became known as St Mary's Parish Church, the same year in which the parish church became St Cuthbert's Parish Church. In 1929, the minister appointed to St Mary's was the Reverend Robert R. Y. B. Minto, and under his guidance the congregation flourished. Many improvements took place such as redecoration of the church and the relaying of the ground around the church hall. Mr Minto's ministry was a long one, and he remained in St Mary's until April 1966, when he was succeeded by the Reverend James Hepburn. Mr Hepburn came to Kirkubri with his wife and young family after having served for some years with the Presbyterian Church in East Africa in Malawi.
It was in 1983 that the merger of St Cuthbert's and St Mary's took place. At first this united change was known as St Cuthbert's and St Mary's Church of Scotland. But by common consent and by consent and by decree of the session, the change reverted to the old name of Kirkubri Parish Church. St Mary's Church building and hall were sold to a developer who converted the interior of the church into flats and built houses adjoining the church on the hall ground. The facade of the church remains the same. Thank you. 